guys and welcome back to SPAPC Cycle 1 Round 2. So today this week was spooky Halloween week. So let's look at the entries that we got. Also sorry about this video is uploaded late. I made the clips um a couple days ago but I wasn't feeling motivated to actually voice over this and film it so yeah that explains that so let's get right in with the video okay so this is the first photo from dolly days ag this is kirsten running from ghosts i really 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 like this photo um i love the setting it seems like the perfect place for a ghost outbreak the only things are are that the lighting does seem to be a bit off and it's shining right on the ghost and I also I can see a bit of the ghost leg um the back ghost leg um legs of the photo which would have been a lot better if that could have been fixed and the lighting is on the ghost so like I think that ghost is a bit off but other than that I really do like this photo so much so great job this week i think this photo is very spooky so you did a very good job so this next photo is from a g pixie dust this photo is very very cute um it is leah dressed as a fairy um i love the outfit it looks so so cute the only thing is that Kind of, if Leah's hair would have been a little bit nicer and maybe the curl in, like, the left side. No, my right side would have been a little bit, like, um, would have been a little bit tucked back. Then that would have been great. Overall, I just think this photo is really pretty. So, I really, really love this photo. I love the... Dolls in the background, how the main focus is on Kit. I love how all the dolls are in costumes. I love the Halloween party decorations. I can clearly tell the concept of this photo, and I love the lighting. The only thing about the lighting is that the lights are red and green, and I think it would have been better if they could be black and orange, or red and orange, or red and black, because red and green is more Christmassy, and it should be more like Halloween. So, yeah, other than that, this is an adorable photo. I love it so much. And this is absolutely stunning. I love the position that Kit is in. This is very, very pretty. So, yes, great job overall. You did amazing this week. And this is a photo from AG Frog Soup. So, this photo is from Amanda Ray, who was the unnamed person during the last um round well the last episode because i totally forgot her username username i'm so sorry um but this is a photo of one of her dolls playing with a ball in a bunch of leaves um i love the filter it makes the doll look very spooky with her black face and then her white eyes i love this filter so much it looks amazing and you did a great great job so yes great job on this photo i really do love it and i love how the ball kind of looks like a moon that's just my perspective i don't know what that's what you meant so this next photo is from forever dollies this is one of her dolls running from a alien monster um i think this photo is super super cute um my only critiques which are like if the alien could have been facing the camera, that would have been great. And the power line is kind of in the way. But, like, I know those are things that you can't fix, so I'm not really going to critique you on that. And I love how some of the doll's hair is kind of blowing in the wind as she runs. I love the doll's outfit, and I love the filter once again. And I really love the tree in the background. And I love how the aspects of this photo all pull together really nicely. And the lighting is super good, and it looks like you put a lot of thought and work into this photo. So, very great job this week. So, I really love this photo. 
This is from from Trinity, and this is a Halloween art contest, and Leah won first place. At least I think this is um, Leah, the doll being used. Um, I love how all the drawings are so, so cute, and I love how you put the little flags or, like, ribbons on the artworks at one. Super adorable. This is great. Her hair looks very nice. I love how her outfit is orange and black. Yes, this photo is very nice. I love all the drawings. You probably worked really hard on that, so great job. So this is the next photo, which is from Doll Girly, and I love all the details in this photo. It looks like they are dolls being produced, and I love how they're all in kind of like Halloween costumes and all of the details put into here and all of the pieces of paper on the floor. Um, the only thing is the donut that I don't really understand, but I think it has something to do with the unicorn. And their hair looks very nice in this photo. And I really like all the details you put into this. And it is definitely very creepy. So you did a great job this time, doll girly. I really, really like this photo. So yes, um, I can tell that you put a lot of hard work onto it. And I love how each of the dolls have numbers on them. It just adds that bit of detail that was really needed to pull this photo together. Um, Yes, I love how the dolls are different sizes, so overall, great job. This photo is from Dolly Dreams. Um, I really like this photo, and um, I love how all the food is there. The only thing is that the background is a little crumpled. I think it might have been a pillow or something in the background. Um, so if that could have been flattened out or a different background, that would have been great. But I can tell that you put a lot of hard work into the background with the decorations. And also, I wish that there were some more dolls, like maybe walking in, maybe a wider shot. But overall, super cute photo. It looks very nice, and you did a great job this week. Um, yeah, great job. So this is our very first week with an elimination. Um... Everybody did so great this week. It is definitely going to be hard to choose a person to eliminate and all the places. Um, yes, everybody did such a great job, and I just want to let you know that this was such a hard choice. Um, yeah, I had help from my parents to pick out the photo, who like pick out the places and who was being eliminated, and I just want to let you know that everybody did a great job. So after a lot of evaluation by me and my family, um, we decided that there will be no eliminations this week, only places. So there are two people tied for seventh place and the rest are just places. First, second, third, fourth, sixth, and tied for seventh we have this photo and this photo. So everybody did so great this round. I am so amazed by all like everybody's creativity i did not see any two photos that looked like congratulations to everyone again this was such a hard choice i could not i had so much trouble picking so yeah you guys all did so so awesome and the next theme is going to be sickness so actually your doll is going to be sick and you can pick the sickness. It can be like cancer, COVID, just a regular flu. Um, yeah, so your doll can be sick. Well, your doll is going to be sick. And you can make her look sick with special effects. I recommend Pixar, which I found out from Dolly Days. You can add stickers there. Um, most of the stickers are free. Some um, do cost money, but most of them are free. So you can probably add some stickers from there. Just a pro tip then yeah that's it for today's video i really hope you enjoyed again congrats to everyone bye and also the photos will be due tuesday 4 p.m central time or like 4 p.m your time try to get them in so yeah that's really it bye